storm of gaming be with you. What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube and Grand Star Legion? Stormstriker S69 here with another Mobile Mayhem video. This will also be part of my RPG series as well as Storm Singularity, but mainly um, Mobile Mayhem. Okay, the game that I will be playing on this video, and I may make a playlist for this game as well at some point. The game that I will be playing is called... Iron Blade, a medieval game. That's... Iron Blade, a medieval RPG. This is a action, adventure, gore, violent, medieval RPG game made by Gameloft. It was on Steam at one point, but not anymore, as it says here. Notice... Iron Blade Medieval RPG is no longer available on the Steam Store, but it's still available through the App Store, Google Play, and you can also get it through the Microsoft uh, on the PC. You can play this game through PC or mobile. This is what the game looks like on the Microsoft Store. I'm playing the PC version, by the way. If you want to play this through Google Play or the App Store, go right ahead. The, I do recommend either the PC or the mobile version. I have recorded the mobile version in the past. It's on my main channel. I will, link, I will put a link to that in the description below so you can see that. What the game looked like from f back in 2019 when the game first released. Yeah, the game came out back in 2018-2019, four years ago. Um, but yeah, this is the fun game. It's also rather addicting as you get into it very quickly. Um, if you're into these kinds of games, go for it. Um, this is one of those games that will also have auto fighting in it, so you click a certain button and the guy fights for you, so you don't have to do anything. You can just watch it, watch all the action, and sit back and enjoy it, you know? It's like watching a movie. <laughs> Anyways. Um, so yeah, let's see what we got here. We got Campaign, Legacy Tower, Daily Dungeons, Tower of Trials. You got the chat down here. And then you got the shop. Alliance, quest, inventory, leaderboard, your mail, all the stuff on the top here, settings, all your currencies and energies and whatnot. Let's go into the campaign. Esquin the Betrayer. We'll do the first mission since I know I've already did it before. Because I've played this game already, but uh, I will do the first mission just for this video. So let's go ahead. And, uh, yes, you do have gear you can get in this game. Think of this as like a hack and slash mobile RPG in the style of Diablo. That's what this is, basically. Except this one's in third person rather than isometric. And you click auto fighting, and they fight. He fights for you. Farewell, devil. The Templar, he's here. You make an ugly. Oh! 
victory! Level up! Got level six. All right, next up I'll do the second mission. The heretic won't get past me. <laughs> My character looks pretty sick, doesn't he? I'm gonna put it out there. I love medieval style games. That's why I play these a lot. Okay, now I'll do the third mission here. Ooh, decapitation! I wasn't kidding about the gore. Oh, what's his head? Stick it to you. Crushing force. I love this game. If you want to, guys, give this game a try. Is there anybody out there that's already been playing this game? Do you guys enjoy it? If there's anybody that's never even heard of this game, give this game a try. I will let you know that this is a very fun game if you're into the medieval-style games. Go for it. If you're into uh, hack-and-slash RPGs, go for it. All right, let's uh, show you the gear page here. This is the gear loadout page. And you can upgrade your weapons with other weapons that you got. It actually makes your stuff a lot stronger. And you can also sell your stuff to get more gold, which I should probably show that. But first, let's go into mission number four, Esquin the Betrayer. We've got to get to the location John Paul gave us before Eskin's sham of a trial turns into an execution. What did John Paul mean when he said it's all true? First, we save our brothers. Then, I'll tell you everything. Then, I will tell you everything. I think he got the point. Come on then, you devil. Ooh. 
you could make it. The Templars have been found guilty of heresy. Once you join your friends in hell, none will stand in my way. Damien, go to Notre Dame. Now! Notre Dame. Side. I'm buying you time, you fool. Don't waste it. Run! Now! This item cannot be upgraded through fusion right now. Let me know. Let me show you how to use evolution to unlock its potential. You'll want good gear in order to prevail against Esquim. This bow is just the thing for the job. Evolution unlocks new levels for your gear and requires gold and rare materials. I will gift them to you this time, but in the future, make sure to loot them by fighting in events. Everything is prepared. You just need to click the evolve button to confirm the upgrade. Good. You should now have the gear you need in order to challenge Esquen. Tap here to leave the screen and proceed. Yeah, but I also have this here, which gives you more gold. No. No ads. At least not while I'm recording. See, if you click sell items. Just like that. And we're going to equip the bow we just got. And we're gonna upgrade it with the other bow. making that bow stronger. Have to update all the tabs or it's gonna annoy you with those little red dots. All right, let's go back to the missions. Esquin, you're going down. But first, Let's do a raid here. So if you click the raid button, it basically simulates the last mission you just did. Yep, this is definitely something Eskin wanted to remain secret. If there's any chance that that secret did not die with him, I'll find it at Notre Dame. If I can make it there. Yep, this is definitely Notre Dame. No, this is not a Disney movie. Yeah. 
Notre Dame is actually a real place. Yes, there is a Disney movie based off of it, if you remember. If it isn't Jacques de Molay's little bastard hellspawn, kill him. There's Esquin. He got the point. <laughs> Goodbye, Esquin. You fight well, Hellspawn, but heed my words. Once Hellspawn, the hunt, you're the Hellspawn. Me. He's gone, and Jock's quarters have been ransacked. There's nothing left except a letter to Flora de Santi. An acquaintance of his. Flora, I fear you were right about Eskin. I need to find this Flora de Santi before Eskin does. Okay. Difficulty unlocked. You have completed all missions on regular with three skulls. Hard is now unlocked. Play greater difficulties for more XP, gold, or better loot. Yep, there is a difficulty system in this game. Regular, hard, extreme, and brutal. I will do one mission on hard. You know, I will, we'll see how this looks. But first, let's change gear. Oh. Challenge rating moderate. All right. Oh, wow. The circles around them, that's their health bar, by the way. I should have saved the health circle. Or it's their circle of life. Oh, a gargoyle. That changes things. A gargoyle wasn't in the first one. Hey, we did it. Victory. And we get a level up. Level seven. Upgrade.
continue. Well, it's not showing that strange number anymore. All right, now that we saw a mission on hard, go ahead and claim this stuff over here. This is where the achievements are, by the way. Okay. I'm going to finish the rest of this video with the hard mode of the first area we just did. And like I said, I may give this game its own playlist because I really like this game. So yeah, same thing with, uh, let's see, the last one I uploaded was Diablo Immortal. This video will be going live after Diablo Immortal. So, Diablo Mortal will also get its own playlist as well, because I really like that game too. Alright. And yes, there are gargoyles in this game. And other creatures. I'm pretty sure there are demons in this game, too. And dragons. And of course, corrupted and undead. There's a gargoyle! Watch your back! Dude, that gargoyle is really kicking your butt, dude. There you go! Got the gargoyle! Demonic bone. Ooh. Those are... Okay, the stuff on the end here, this is ingredients you get for taking out certain creatures like that gargoyle I took out. And it helps you upgrade the weapons. Or your skills, even. Got level eight.
Okay, this is this here. This is where you do your evolutions. Like we saw, see the skull thing here. If we get more of those, then we'll be able to upgrade this weapon to two stars. Fusion as well. And of course, Ascendance. You can also ascend your weapons to five stars if, if you have enough stuff. Of course, you need more of basic Divine Essence to get them ascended. Okay, guys. Let's check out the Tower of Trials. Enter the tower. Acquire tokens by completing trials. Save your points after defeating bosses or risk them for more. Losing a trial will end your tower run. Increase your score by choosing the boss bonus after defeating a boss. Get powerful trials gear to further increase your score. Trials gear score bonuses will expire at the end of the current event, but the gear is yours to keep. Enter floor one. Wait a minute. That looks exactly like the first mission. It's part of it's in the tower itself. So much. I think he got the point. Decapitation! Victory!
So that's the Tower of Trials. As you, you can see, the fur you can go the further up, the more you want to do. Let's see. We did the first two here. Think of this like Mortal Kombat, basically. How you have the arcade mode. Stage one, all the way up to the boss. And this tower is infinite by the looks of it. Oh, it goes up to, here's the top of the tower. 40 is the top of the tower. And to unlock that, you have to go all the way up there. Tell me, do you guys like the Tower of Trials? Have you done it before? Things like that. Now let's check out the Legacy Tower. The Legacy Tower is the same as the Trials Tower, except this one. Ooh. Let's see what the Forge is. Legacy Forge. Drag a card onto the slot to craft a random item or troop of its type with random attributes. Mystery Weapon, Mystery Armor, Mystery Mercenary, Mystery Commander. Alright, let's check out... Let's see what this is all about. Alright, this is me. Legacy Tower. Total enemy health. Oh, I see what this is now. This is one of those endless uh, modes. You have to beat them within a certain time. And I guess you have different waves and stuff like that. And you can't heal either, by the way. Oh, but it gave you a shield. Critically wounded. Try again for a chance to get these rewards. Well, as you can see, the Legacy Tower is a bit difficult. As it says, recommended stats, 800 and 800. 800 attack, 800 defense. Each floor can be completed once per, only once per reset. So this tower resets every day. I believe the uh, the Tower of Trials also resets as well. Let's check out the daily dungeons. Heroic Booster. It looks like a rock and smells like fusion somehow. You're definitely not curious about the taste. Daily dun Dungeon Fusion Boosters regular. Chapter 1, Mission 3 regular. It's Notre Dame! The heretic won't get stuck! Yeah! <laughs> Look, we got the recommended gear score for this. Oh, there's a gargoyle. Ready. Oh. 
Decapitation! Gargoyle is down. We got two skulls for that. And it gave us a card as well. So when you do dungeons, it gives you cards, basically. And then you also have fortresses. Of course, to unlock that, you have to finish chapter two to unlock. And over here, you have an arena where you can battle random people across the world or I think they're AIs as well. I don't know AIs. Not, not that kind of AI, Starman. I'm talking about like CPUs. Yeah. Anyways, let's see. Power rating. I hope I have what I need to do this. My power rating is 14,690. This one is higher than me. Okay. As you can see, you have to be a certain level to do that. So we're not gonna do that just yet. But we wanted to ch I wanted to check it out anyways. Let's go ahead and open up the chests. Ooh. This down here is the free and league chest, which you can get every so often. They also have packages you can get. You don't have to get them if you don't want to. Of course, for me, I'm basically playing this game for free, not using any money at all, and basically getting through the game the hard way, which happens to be earning the stuff, you know. Okay, so the helmet we just got is three, the helmet I'm wearing now is three stars, but the one we just got Looks like it might be better. So I'm going to upgrade this helmet that I'm wearing. I'm keeping the blue one because why not? I need to upgrade my sword. I do that on my own time. Yeah, all the upgrading stuff I'll do w outside of recording. See, you've got your hero, armor and weapons, materials, and boosters. Put up your sword, scoundrel! <laughs> 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 Oh, 
items and uh, you can get those in this game this is definitely like Diablo so I got the uh, Iron King set just now I got the Hilbert and hands piece yeah it's two stars right now but I can rank it up um, yeah it's pretty cool this is definitely like Diablo. You've got your sad items, unique items, legendary items, ancient items. It goes up there. It's pretty cool.
As you can see, after you beat hard mode, you unlock extreme mode, which makes it even more of a challenge. So make sure you're prepared before you do extreme mode. As you can see, recommended stats, 1000 damage, 900 defense. Challenge rating is on extreme for me right now. But if I get my recommended stats to those recommendations, that rating system will change to moderate, well, to hard, then moderate, then easy. So as your stats go up, the rating goes down. All right, so that'll do it for this first video for Iron Blade. A medieval RPG. I am Stormstriker SX9. If you enjoyed this game or video, please remember to click the like button, comment below, share with your friends, add the favorites, and click that subscribe button. And also don't forget to click that notification bell to know when we upload new videos. Like I said in the beginning, I will put my video that I did of this game on my main channel in the description below so you can check that out as well. And then I will be continuing this game as well. So I'm going to get off of this video and basically grind so I can get my guys stronger and whatnot. And then we'll continue with Chapter 2 on the next video. So until then, I will see you guys next time.